it touched me. It, it hit me hard. And um, I felt it. I felt like I had to do something, right? So uh, I'm, I went over there. I'm, I'm not about lights and cameras or anything like that. But what I did was they were having a press conference. I wasn't really feeling it. I stayed to the side, just listening, observing. Then while at the press conference, I just start calling everybody in my phone. You have to do something for the family. You have to show them that we care. You have to show them that we hurt. And the next day, the Friday, I mean, I had like so many people out there. I had, I had, a, I had a DJ set up on the Easter on Easter Parkway with, with playing gospel music and, and letting people and letting, letting the family know they're there. The violence interrupters came, clergy came. Uh, Nation of Islam came. I want the Jews to come too, the Jewish people, but it was Friday, so they couldn't come. But I want to show unity. And I think that's a big part of this community that we're missing, this unity. You know, there's so much, to, you know, devices, you know, everybody's separated. Everybody's like, come see the crab, crabs in a barrel. Like, one person has to do something, and we're all pulling each other down, and we're not getting anywhere. We're not getting anywhere. It's like the same cycle all over and over and over again. So I'm here today because I know everybody here has a situation or a complaint, a concern, an issue. I'm gonna listen to it. I'm not gonna listen. I, I might not be able to get to all of them today, but I'll make sure that I'll leave my email, whatever, and we're gonna address it. But we all have to do it together. No one person can stand alone. You know, I don't have a detachment. When I walk out of my house, this, this is my neighborhood too. I see the same things you see. I feel the same things you feel. I feel hurt also. So going back to this young lady that was killed in September, man, that was a, that was a, that was a hard one. You know, she was innocent. And then she, all she was doing was just came outside on the steps and was praying. And talking to her sister. She didn't choose that. She didn't choose to die right there. And then yesterday, you know, fast forward, forward and I went to a funeral. You know, Eric, the mayor was there, he came paid his respects. And um, I stood up and I spoke. I wasn't really on to it, I'm not really, I'm, a, I'm not really a public speaker. But I, I guess I speak from my heart at times. And in that church, I told everyone, I asked them to say her name. And I made them say their name several times in that church. And I told them that everybody in life has a purpose. We all have to find our purpose. And I asked, I made them say their name again. Because I told them that this young lady didn't get a chance to finish her purpose. You know, she, 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 she planned for tomorrow, and she planned for that day. She never got it tomorrow, and her life was ended on that day. We have today, hopefully we have tomorrow. What are we gonna do today, tomorrow, and moving forward? I just can't sit here and just ask the police to solve all our situations. We have to come together and find a way to solve it ourselves also. The seniors, the youth, everyone. Everyone has to be heard. You know, you know, I, my family's lived in this community for over 30, 40 years. So I see I seen I seen the cycle. The people just came here. They're just they're just noticing what's going on and we don't remember the, the crack epidemics and it was times where in the front of my house I had bushes I had to pull all the bushes up because it was hiding all the drugs in the bushes <laughs> and now I'm taking the bushes back <laughs> to get in, front, get in front of my house you know so you, you tell me how it goes you know I look I look at everybody right here I see I see the faces I see I see Concerns. 
What are we going to do to make our community better? Mm -hmm. Tell me what you need that I can help you or we can help you. But if I ask you to help or you ask me to help, I'm going to need your help also. Well, yeah, like uh, my particular block, to put their school there.